Bam! Me and Babe, we out here today. We're at Universal Orlando Resort. Velocicoaster. It's Velocicoaster time. But I am here doing a segment called Gabby's Reviews. So we just got off the Incredible Hulk. What did you think? I haven't been on it since 2009, so very pleasantly surprised at how good it is. I just really, really hate those restraints and BNM really should figure something else out. Because it's not the ride itself, it's just those bulky restraints kind of like ruined my vibe when I was trying to buy. If that makes sense. But it's a really good ride. I really like to just kind of keep my head like that. I thought it was running. Um, I had these little like clippies and uh, they were hurting. But maybe I'm just dumb for wearing them on it. But. Maybe. All right. But I guess that's what you thought about the Incredible Hulk. Love it. I thought it was great. Super intense. It's All right. Real fast. Tell me what you thought about Mind Blower last night. Real quick. All right, fam. We just got off Kong. For some reason, Gabby wants to tell you about this ride. Because it's spooky, and I'm personally offended that literally no one ever told me that it was spooky and that maybe I would like it. First off, you see skulls at the entrance, and then it's like all spooky inside, and then there's people on spikes. Say less. I already loved it in the queue. And then there's giant bats. Ugly bat things. 10 out of 10. King Kong's man. I will say that. Let's just marathon this all day. Marathon. Here we go again. Bam! We're here. We're about to get on Forbidden Journey. But Gabby is about to tell you about her ride on the last coaster. Babe, what did you think? Well, to put it frankly and full dramatics, I would die from the last coaster. And that's sad on that. Dude, it was pulling balls today. It was freaking insane. I need it all for many seconds. Every little thing I love about it. Sure, absolute insanity. Uh, I gotta finish my drink, so you can watch me do that while Gabby talks more about it. Uh, Bib, also I want to ask you, is that in the back row over that top hat, is that not Skyrush level objective? Scott, okay, yes. I still think Skyrush is a little more like intense on that drop, particularly. But I still think Velocicoaster overall is just like the perfect package it has. Every little thing I love about rides or roller coasters, whatever, in one ride, it's like absolute insanity. And as an Intamin fan, Intamin lore, it's just chest kiss. Thank you. It's amazing. All right, on to the next one. What are we do? Oh, Forbidden Journey, and then uh, I don't know, maybe more Velocicoaster. Gabby's reviews for Kumba. I haven't ridden it in 13 years and I completely forgot how intense this thing is. I'm a little shook right now. Like that, the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue. I'm shook. The um, zero G into the Cobra roll is so freaking crazy. It might be getting old though. Yeah. A little roundly for me. I, I thought it was perfectly smooth though. What? No. You win some, you lose some, whatever. But I would like to thank both Bollinger and Lavalard for this one. Great, great. That went the whole tour of Bollinger and Lavalard. Yes. Uh, also, let's talk about how it doesn't even let up after that mid course. Like, literally, second half is not boring at all. So, it's bring insane. That uh, you dive, no. you dive into. Oh, hold on, babe, come back. So you dive down into the tunnel, that helix, how I intense. Insane, insane. Yeah. Kumba, yes. Fam! All right, we just got off Iron Quasi. Well, a little bit ago, because now we're in the parking lot. What'd you think? I still like Velocicoaster better. Oh my God, it was freaking insane though. But you do be eated, ejector do be violent. Best RMC and way better than Steel Vengeance, and that's that on that. It's definitely better than Steel Vengeance. I'm argue. Is, is it the best RMC? Yes. 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 And I, personally, and I still think it's better than Velocicoaster, but. 
It, the last of those two. But like, it's not like there's a huge disparity between them. It's like they're very close. I just the last of those two do the launchings and the whippy turns. Truth. Big fan on the whippy turns, man. But, All right, you heard uh, it here. Ma uh, the makeup is still on. It is on fleek um, and the outfit. Worth it. Sticky for the ride. day here. Look at that. It's still looking Lucky fire. All right, fam. That's it for Gabby's reviews. Episode one. Tune back next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace. To get the feeling right.